Hi, my name is Lynn and I do DIY beauty and as of lately, I have incorporated Jesus into my videos and for today, we are doing a Jesus video. Today, I want to teach you how to pray powerful prayers and don't worry, this is not going to be a long video. I'm going to keep it right to the point. So in order to pray powerful prayers, you need to be able to pray with conviction. You need to be able to pray with power. You need to know who your father is. You need to be able to rip out the scriptures and declare those scriptures. Stop praying prayers that are filled with doubt. John 22 verse 8 says, if we declare a thing, it will be established for us. Luke 10 verse 19, Jesus says, I have given you authority to trample over snakes and scorpions and over all the power of the enemy and nothing shall hurt you. This tells us that we have authority through Jesus Christ to declare things and they will happen and they will change. Things will change once you pray those prayers, once you declare it from a place of authority, knowing that you are the daughter, the son of our Lord and Savior. So how do we pray with power? How do we put these things into practice? We stop negotiating. We stop being wishy-washy about our prayers. We stand firm in the authority that Jesus has given us. We approach the throne of grace with boldness. God says, come to me with boldness. That boldness to make bold declarations. That boldness to make bold statements. Simply stop negotiating in your prayers. Make bold declarations because you are standing in the power in the authority that was given unto you you are standing in the power of Jesus Christ and once you start praying knowing that feeling that knowing that your father is there to cover you to protect you you will start to pray with more conviction with more power with more spirit with more vigor knowing that your father has already won the battle to stop praying mediocre prayers stop negotiating be serious if you want to pray come with seriousness because this is not jokes our Christ is way too powerful. We are way too powerful to be living mediocre lives and to pray mediocre prayers. Okay, my sis? So I hope this video gave you some sort of feeling and vigor to next time when you pray, you pray from a place of truth. You pray from a place of knowing that your father is there and he is backing you up in everything, in all your prayers, he's backing you up, he's there, his spirit is there, waiting and ready to back you up. And that is how you pray powerful prayers. If you have any more questions, or if you want me to touch on anything else, please ask me. My comments are open, ask me, I will make time, or I will at least try my best to record for you. Thank you so much for watching my sis and take care of yourself. I will pray for you and your family as I usually do. Thank you for watching and see you next time. Mwah.